so in the previous video we have visualized our waypoint as you can see now we know that where our waypoint exists in our environment now in this video I want to visualize the waypoint width area as you know that we have a width value right here for each of the waypoint so for the width we will draw a line and that line will show us the walkable area for the AI character to walk in so after this uh, sphere code we need to color our width line so for that we will say gizmos dot color and this will be equals to color dot white after this I want to show the width line from the center of this waypoint to the left and to the right side so it means that in a straight line and that straight line will increase whenever we increase the width of the waypoint so for that right here we will say gizmos dot draw line and we want to draw line as I told you from the waypoint position so we will say waypoint dot transform dot position and then in which direction we will type that right here as I told you I want to draw it in the straight line okay which means it will start from here then it will go to the left side and to the right side so it will be shown as a single line and that line will increase with the waypoint width so we will say waypoint dot transform dot right and we will multiply that by the waypoint width as I told you because it will increase whenever we increase the waypoint width so we will say waypoint dot waypoint width let's divide that by 2f then let's add double quotes again and in here we will say waypoint dot transform dot position now we want to draw the line in the left direction as well so we can't use the dot left keyword for that we will use the minus sign and actually let's remove these round brackets from there and let's add it right here okay and in here we will say waypoint dot transform dot right and from the right side it will also increase with the waypoint width so we will say waypoint dot waypoint dot width and let's multiply this by 2f that is it now after this waypoint width now we will draw a line from the previous waypoint to the next waypoint but that is for the next video for now let's just test this out if we save this and get back to unity now you can notice the width of each of the waypoint as you can see now when we try to increase or decrease the value the waypoint increase and decrease with it okay this line now let me delete all of these three waypoints let's create another one now as you can see it is facing that side but we can change the side of it like this okay now we can create another one and move that in the forward direction and as you can see it is facing now in the same direction and when we try, try to increase the width of it the line also increase with it and the maximum value is 5 so that's why it can only be increased to 5 so this is it for this video and in the next video we will connect our waypoints